A renewed focus tonight on the safety of Queen City streets following a hit and run that killed a 27 year old woman on Bailey Avenue. Shantia Dickinson was crossing the street when she was hit last week. Police are still looking for suspects in that crash and believe she was hit by a white colored SUV. Porter Natalie Fahmy joins us now after speaking with neighbors along Bailey who say changes to road safety are long overdue. Jeff, I stood at the corner on Broadway in Bailey for 30 minutes Tuesday for another story and noticed the crosswalk signal did not change once to give pedestrians the right of way. So I went back today and spoke with residents in the, who live in the neighborhood who say this is no surprise. It's always unsafe over here. Christopher Johnson has lived in Buffalo for more than 40 years, and he's now lived near Broadway and Bailey for about eight months. Things need to change at this intersection. Here's what the crosswalk looked like Wednesday morning. 15 minutes go by here and no signal change for pedestrians to cross. So I push the button, still no change. Residents say it's nothing new. It's been frustrating all my life because I've been around here all my life. Frustrating? <laughs> frustrated, I don't think frustrating is the word. Johnson says he was good friends with 27 year old Shantia Dickinson, who died crossing the street at Bailey and Broadway last week. He says people behind the wheel need to slow down. People need to be mindful of what they're doing and stop being in such a rush. Because wherever they're going is still going to be there by the time they get there. I've seen accidents multiple times. I've seen pedestrians run up to my car multiple times. It's just an everyday thing. Neighbors tell me change is overdue. When it comes to the city, I really feel like they really don't care about this part of town. They say Buffalo, the uh, uh, city of good neighbors, but if you're in a car, I guess people aren't too good as being neighbors. I reached out to the Department of Public Works multiple times to ask who's responsible for overseeing pedestrian crossing signals and how often they're maintained, but have not heard back yet. If you notice a crosswalk signal in your neighborhood not working, you can call 311 to file a request that it gets looked at. Live in studio, Natalie Fahmy, 7 News.